is very happy at and is open to signing a new contract with the club, according to reports. Fernandez is currently in the headlines for the wrong reasons, having missed a penalty in the dying stages of United's defeat by Aston Villa, but he still looks poised to commit his future to the club. Fernandez blazed his 93rd minute penalty over the crossbar on Saturday as Courtney Hauser's late goal earned Villa a 1-0 win at Old Trafford. The Portuguese attacking midfielder opened himself up to plenty of criticism with the incident which made it two defeats in a week, and three in four games, for United following the Carabao Cup loss against West Ham. While things are not going right on the pitch for Ole Gunnar Solskjaer's side at the moment, the club are still busy off it. With the transfer window now closed, the club are concentrating on trying to sign their key players to new contracts. Paul Pogba is the most pressing of those concerns, with the midfielders' current deal set to expire at the end of the season. Pogba has been strongly linked to Paris Saint-Germain and Real Madrid and is yet to decide on his future. A bumper new contract has been on the table for months at Old Trafford and transfer. Journalist Fabrizio Romano writes for that Pogba is loving the atmosphere at the club recently. United hope to be able to extend the agreement soon, but they have much more optimism when it comes to Fernandez. Talks with Fernandez agent began in the first week of July and United reportedly know that renewing his contract is essential apostrophe. According to, Fernandez currently earns £180,000 per week with United, meaning he is nowhere near the club's top earner. Unsurprisingly, that honor goes to Cristiano Ronaldo, who is on £385,000 a week following his transfer from Juventus. Goalkeeper David De Gea, £375,000, and Ronaldo's fellow new signings Jadon Sancho, £350,000, and Rafael Veron, £340,000, reportedly come next. While he has been offered a bumper new deal, Pogba is currently on £290,000 a week, while Anthony Marshall and Edinson Cabani are on £250,000 per week, ahead of Marcus Rashford, £200,000, and Harry Maguire, £189,000. On the pitch, United will be hoping to turn around their form when they take on Villarreal in the Champions League on Wednesday. Solskjaer's side lost to the Spanish team in the Europa League final in May and are already on the back foot in the competition, having lost their opening game 2-1 to young boys.